We are in Windows Server 10, and I'm going to show you now what the new start menu looks like. So here we are. It's, this is in a VM, so we have that on our host 8.1 machine, but here's our Windows Server 10. So click on the start button and take a look. Looks like the old start menu. Click on all apps, and we can see server manager, pictures, documents, maintenance. Let's take a look at administrative tools. So we see mostly the same thing. Terminal services, which is surprising, it's not called remote desktop services. And we have maintenance, also empty. Windows accessories, all the standards. There is a steps recorder, which has been added. System tools, which is server backup. Ease of access for disabilities and Windows System for command prompts, control panel, and other things like that. Run command. That's a nice addition. So that's the uh, start menu. Let's go ahead and right click on the start menu. And look at that. We see a lot of options. Power, programs, event viewer, all the things that we'd see in the administrative tools with some additional extras. And we also have the shutdown options, sign out, shutdown, and restart. And there's the desktop option. So it's the Windows Server Start Menu in Windows Server 10.